Hey, hey, Miles. Pete. Hey, um, sorry I'm late, man. Oh, no, no, I'm just glad you're here. All right, so, um, what can I do to help? Why don't you start just by, uh, getting comfortable with the place. Uh, meet a few people. You know what? Everybody loves coffee. Coffee? All right. And I'll be back in a little while to check on you. Is that cool? Yeah. Oh, don't worry about Mr. Hodges. He doesn't bite. Much. You sure? Coffee? Thanks. Need help? Not unless you know what the hell a quark is. It's a subatomic particle. You know, the building block of protons, neutrons, hadrons? Subatomic? It fits. Good one, kid. Piece of junk. <laughs> oh, hell. Damn hunk of junk. Uh, you mind if I take a look? Huh? Oh, we have a couple of CRTs at school. I know how to fix these CR when they're... CR what? No, no, you just gotta smack it. Up the time. Get it. Go! Or, could be a loose coax cable. <sighs> all right, all right. Be my guest, huh, Mr. Smarty Pants? Hey, please, go ahead. Tributes continue to pour in for Officer Jefferson Davis, the hero killed in the City Hall bombing, as reports emerged that he used his own body to shield others in his last moments of life. Hey, new kid. I'm empty wife, here. Rio and son Miles, as well as brother Aaron. In addition to the hero. Man didn't do nothing heroic except get himself blown up. Hey, Ernie. I see you've met Miles. He's gonna be helping out around here. You may have heard of his father, Jefferson Davis. Pretty great that even though he's got a lot of stuff going on right now, he decided to come and volunteer. Don't you think? Uh, yeah, yeah. Um, thanks. Uh, listen, Cat, I'm, I'm... Sorry about your dad. Come on, Miles. See if Aunt May needs a hand in the kitchen. Hey, May. I gotta take off, but, uh... Brought some help for you. Hi, Miles. Nice to see you. Well, grab an apron, wash your hands, and I'll show you around. Hey, hey Peter. Um, thanks for that back there. Of course. Almost noon. Sable should be moving Dr. Michaels. Better get to the Bowery and locate him. I'm afraid our computers are a bit outdated. Well, that's cool. I might be able to improve their performance for you. Really? That would be extremely helpful. Thank you. Peter, be careful out there. Miles told me the Sable patrols are being very strict. So I looked right at the Sandman and said, this is a shelter. There's nothing to steal. Get out. And he did. What? That is awesome! <laughs> You've got some pretty cool stories, Mrs. P. May told me about your parents and Uncle Ben. Sorry I snapped at you at the funeral. All good, Miles. Hey, if you ever want to talk, I'm here. Peter, Miles says he can connect all the feast shelters on one network. Dude, May said you turned down a job at Oscorp to work at a startup. Much respect. Pete, I'm gonna be fine. You're worse than my mom. Pete, don't mouth off to those Sable guys. They're not playing. I'll be careful.
I think like tyrants. They don't care about our rights. Oh, gotta get an ID so Sable stops hassling me. the kids back hey Pete your aunt's really stepped up yeah she's the best so how's it going with your daughter Eileen slow I made mistakes raising her hard to get past if you're talking there's hope don't give up now that's a wise man right there are getting along great. Good to hear. I heard Sable lock Tony up just for panhandling. Miles has had it rough. Sometimes that means you don't want anyone's help. You still need it. Speaking from experience? Thanks to your aunt, I got a job at the Coffee Bean. Turns out, if I remember not to curse, I'm pretty good with people. I could have told you that. Way to go, Gloria. What about my dog? Hey, Yuri. I'm heading to the Bowery to make sure Michaels gets to his new safe house. You know, safely. I wouldn't do that. Silver Sable made it clear you are not welcome. Yeah, well, what's she gonna do? Shoot me? Honestly, 50-50 chance. Ah, fine. I'll be in the neighborhood, but not too close. Just in case. Pandemic, end of the world, that kind of thing. Why did I even ask?
Stable control. Need a report of the situation north of Housen. Outpost is under siege by demons. the Bowery, but where's Dr. Michaels? We're ready for you, Dr. Michaels. Is that the devil's breath? It's called GR-27, not... <sighs> Just be careful. In the wrong hands, this could... Don't worry. We're the best in the world. <sighs> I feel better already. Code 381, package is on the move. This way, Dr. Michaels. What the hell is that? Yeah, sure you do. Yuri, I'm in pursuit of Martin Lee. I think he's got Dr. Michaels and the Devil's Breath. Copy that. More units coming your way. Took Michaels alive, so that's good. Probably, so we can force him to make more Devil's Breath. I have to stop that truck. Tank, whatever. the guys in the trucks before I go after Lee. Coming, and he will destroy all sinners! Sorry! Lee, hand it over! 
lend me a certain persuasiveness. I've been watching you. I was waiting for you at City Hall. You never came. Where were you? Is this real or in my mind? It was a shame so many had to die with no heroes to save them. That officer saved your life, didn't he? He was here because of you. And Norman wanted to use him. A futile gesture in the end. And where was Norman during all this? Slinking away like a rat. He knew what was going to happen, and he fled. Norman is a hidden cancer on this city. He must be exiled with no trace of his corruption to return. Norman hides behind his mask of lies. I will break it apart and drag him into the light. Put on the mask. Become one of us. Thanks, but no thanks! One way or the other, you will join me. Uh oh You've lost the innocent victims you couldn't save. Martin, their blood is on your hands. You can stop Oswald. You have so much strength. I can give you will. Their bodies filled the gutter. You did nothing! I can't save everyone! What's one life? A simple trip. One life for a city of souls. You defend Osborne while he sits in his ivory tower? This isn't real. Show me your true strength!
you okay? Did they take it? Yes. How worried should I be? Very. You're a popular guy. Where is the serum? I'm gone. The Discoya. So-called superhero. You think you save people, but you just make it worse. This is your fault. My fault? He was under your protection. Do you really need two of those? Stop! We need to brief Mr. Osborne now. I'll go with her. Thank you. I'll remember this. Tell me you've got a lead on Martin Lee's location. We have footage from a guy at a coffee shop. Looks like he hopped into a black sedan after the crash. Black sedan, great. Let me finish. We have a partial plate. And one of my patrol guys just found a matching plate. Black sedan in a parking lot near Canal and Hudson. You're a good cop, Yuri. I'm on my way. Spider-Man. Hello? Is this working? Dr. Michaels? How are you calling? Borrowed one of Sable's radios. Listen, transit hubs are the most likely release points for Devil's Breath. Airports, bus terminals, train stations. It'll spread like wildfire from there. Why the hell is Oscorp developing a bioweapon in the city? Shouldn't this be in an Arctic bunker? Devil's Breath is personal for Norman. It's been his obsession for decades. The project breaks every state and federal regulation on the books, but he doesn't care. If the city finds out, he can kiss re-election goodbye. Never mind re-election. He'd be tried in The Hague for war crimes. Why are you telling me all this? Aren't you just as culpable as Norman? Yes. Completely. But Lee's actions have been a wake-up call. We've ignored the project's risk for too long. I trust you, Spider-Man. You're the only one trying to do the right thing. Please, protect the city from our mistakes. Units, mass terrorists have taken a bus hostage. Incident was reported near the meatpacking district. Doc left word. Parker, I wanted to thank you. Your work on the neural interface has been invaluable. I wish you could see what that means right now. But it's beginning to dawn on me just how powerful and insidious the forces arrayed against true visionaries are. I promise you, though. It won't be long. Success will come, whatever it takes. Powerful and insidious forces. I don't like the sound of that. Need to check on Doc when I get a chance. Devil's breath is gone. I should call MJ and Warner. This is Mary Jane Watson. Please leave a detailed message and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. What are you up to now, MJ?
Standish said the demons are looking for something at GCT. But what could they possibly need here? Should probably call Peter and let him know what I'm doing. Actually, scratch that. He'd probably just tell me to go home and chain myself to my laptop. I'll just check things out quick and let him know what I find. I heard Spider-Man's got some kind of, like, danger sense. So why didn't he know? From paper cuts to gunshot wounds, Oscorp's patented nanotechnology can increase the body's healing rate by 1,000 times. We're not just saving you money, we're saving lives. Oscorp's patented array of intelligent, sensory-equipped munitions has reduced accidental casualties on the battlefield by over 94%. Huh. Oscorp's research and development team are hard at work on a radical new form of battery that recharges itself from sound waves. In a few short months, you will be able to buy a phone that will never have to be plugged in. Hmm. Cool. If you see any suspicious activity, please report it to the nearest security team number. Oscorp's Revolutionary Medical Evacuation Drone, or MED, offers immediate emergency assistance, even in the most hostile areas of the world. Encrypt your data with Oscorp Cerberus Cipher, the world's only mathematically proven unbreakable encryption algorithm.